And then here we are at the bridge and it's a bittersweet time to say 10 years because we would much rather not have to be doing Code Pink. Right. Uh, mm -hmm. We would much rather be able to say we no longer have wars going on that our country is perpetrating, that we don't have troops in Afghanistan anymore, that we don't have these drone strikes, that we're not crippling the economy of Iran and threatening uh, another war with Iran, that we're not still giving three billion dollars a year to Israel to violate the basic human rights of the Palestinians and keep settlements going and the siege of Gaza. We would much rather be here celebrating that our country represents um, a peaceful, compassionate country and that shows that face to the rest of the world. So we continue to be the citizen diplomats we want our country to be, like we just did in our trip to Pakistan to say that we are totally opposed to our government's policies of killing people with these drone strikes. And here we are today to say we are walking across this beautiful Gold Gate Bridge to say we will still keep fighting and struggling until we do have a government that represents the compassion that we think the American people should be standing for around the world. That we went, When we travel around the world to a place like Pakistan, it breaks our hearts when we hear that three out of four people in Pakistan think of the United States as its enemy, when we want 100% of people around the world to think of the United States as its friend. So that's what we're going to keep uh, walking and marching and singing for.